Good morning to one and all present here. So today I ask a score. And I say Sanju. A class eight are here by representing our project on the sub things provided by CBSC. So as you can see here, it's a house and a hut, and the most important is the field. The mechanism of this field is that when you irrigate the first layer, it would automatically percolate down and irrigate the second layer as well due to dripping. So. As you can see, in the middle of the magniculture is one windmill. The purpose of this windmill is to provide cheap electricity to the farmers, putting an end to the farmers' hectic of buying private electricity. In the corner of the magniculture is one oxygen farm. The purpose of this oxygen farm is to provide good amount of oxygen to the crops, because in this we have put algae and water. And the uh, and as you know that algae is a good source of uh, good source of oxygen. This oxygen would enhance the growth of the uh, crops. Now I would like Sudhi to explain some of the advantages of this magnetism. Yes, for of course. So I would like to tell you the facts. That is why magnetism is required in the bees. So because you know magnets provide a physical growth, a perfect water circulation, and protection from weeds, pests. and so thus they can provide a good quality and quantity food to farmers and they can earn a huge amounts of profits and since we customers will be satisfied by their products you will buy more and see how our economic develop economic develops and this oxygen farm this can be installed in mars as well because in mars we astronauts need a lot of oxygen and this bacteria that is algae can survive in extreme conditions and provide 50% more oxygen so now i would like to conclude my project by saying that this is a great idea that can be installed in both earth and mars and can also be a huge boon to farmers and us the customers as well thank you and have a nice day and